If you not fucking with Philly, my nigga, we not fucking with you. Two my five, so we fucking die, feel me, homie? Welcome back to the Center Podcast. Got Mark to my left, Quinn to my right. How are y'all feeling today? It's been a minute, guys. I know, actually, it hasn't been a week. It's been it's quite windy today. It Opened up my trunk and it closed right back on me. So. <laughs> well, that's the worst. <clears throat> no, what used to be the worst is like when it's really windy or when there's a storm and you're like coming home or something and you're trying to open your door, like the screen door, and then it just shuts like that. <laughs> and I'm like, damn it, hurry up. I'm trying to get inside. <laughs> Did you ever see the video of the little girl who opened the screen door and it, the wind pushed it so she flew she with the flew screen with door? It, yeah, because it's one of those houses that had like the stairs you walk up to the door and then like she was just. You don't got no railing, so yeah. you just like. <laughs> you just playing with the, my shit don't got no railing so i'm talking shit but i'll be going when it's when it's ice and shit and then be when it's ice on my steps i sure be bitching dog i'll be like if i fall i fall it's over i'll be playing because my dad didn't get no railing yet so sucks probably not getting a railing at all nah I don't <laughs> it's kind of like uh, i was driving today on the highway and it's just my car is small, so like the whole time I'm just like, <laughs> just like <laughs> rocking back and forth. I'm like, any minute I could just like fly into the next lane, like on some bullshit. <laughs> it was over. For I just feel that on my car. Hit when hit this was like, boom. I was like, okay. Stay on, girl. Stay down. <laughs> Whoa, Nelly. <Nettie. laughs> That's how I look when I opened the when I opened the trunk. It kept closing. I was just like, all right, I can, like put it down. Then I wait for this wind to stop, and I'm like, this shit, now nah, stop it. <laughs> so I'm like, all right. I like looked at it halfway to grab what I needed, then I was like, all right, let's just put this back down. And then I had to put the oil in my car, so when I lifted up the hood, and I put the jaw on to you know, stop it from closing, I thought that shit was about to fly the fuck off, and the fucking wind was coming. I'm like, all right. I'm like holding it down, I'm like this, I'm like. <sighs> the wind's still coming, I'm like, yo. And then something got in my eye, I was like, what the fuck? Bitch ass wind. Bitch ass wind. <laughs> I had checked the weather app and then you know how like they like the little sign for like what the weather is. I've just seen all these swirls like <laughs> down my jaw. I'm like, damn, it's gonna be blowing today. <laughs> it's probably I don't know. It's probably still there. But yeah, what's new guys? It is. Well, for it just says like two to four. No, my jaw is from like till midnight, like <laughs> nothing but little squigglies. You are right, Q? Mm-hmm. What's new, guys? So. Um, not much. Why well, look like you got it? What do you want? Oh, you're on I wanted to see what Pokemon, Pokemon are strong right now. Wow. Because it's windy. Look, they got a little Pokemon kite. We're doing a podcast, son. We're Thank talking you. about wind. I wanted to look at the Pokemon set. It looked like you was on a galaxy. That's why I was confused. <laughs> like when you change phones. Weird. Yeah. It's, it's a good life right now, you know? The Eagles kind of gave us a heart attack, but we won. Like always. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's any Philly sport. It's like we always lit up. Bro, it's, and then, it's like, yo, we got we up like 30, yo. We got this last quarter. <laughs> just straight. Yeah. Yo, we losing by two, dog. Everyone, <laughs> we, got, everyone, we got no timeouts. Everybody be chilling. They don't even be sitting and like watching the game. They'll be like talking yeah. to other people, moving around. Yeah, like, you know, I, mean, I watch them go eat some. That's two. Like, it'll be the last freaking two minutes, and it's like 2.2. Two, and we're like, yo, yo, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. <laughs> Just be staring. <laughs> like, yo, come on. Yeah, shout out Cody Perky, former Eagle. He was like, you know, I'm going to throw the team for my squad. <laughs> Russia was probably what he was. They probably beat him. Well, even though we blocked it. Yeah, I heard it. <laughs> <laughs> they put up the video of the Bulls trying to get initiated to the Crips, and he was getting beat the fuck oh, up. Yeah. They said Cody Perky when he went into the locker room. <laughs> like, fight back. Fight back. Yeah, I was so hyped. Because first, that fourth, that, like, we kept... We was like literally like fourth and or not like first and goal and we ran it with Sproles three times. Little ass Sproles when we got to That's what two I was husky, saying. I was like, yo, backs. not to mention like you were just I mean, it's understandable to go straight through the middle because you're right there, so it's the fastest yeah. way. But you picked the smallest yeah, dudes. Yeah, <laughs> like he, then the last time, um, what was it? Yeah, it was the last time we tried to jump over mm-hmm. and they said that it didn't count when you Yeah, went which I think it did because because they said it broke the plane. It was just not enough because the bull was standing in front of the drone. But also, like, 
they could have even ran it with Nick Foles. Like Nick Foles is like six five. Like he could have just like, <laughs> and we would have been good. Yeah, because that was it. That that would have been it if we would have got that. And he got like, yeah. a little bit. And, stuff, and yeah, he would have been fine. Like it's not like he would have had to keep going. Yeah, but it would have made life well, so much easier, even though we still, you know. And I, I literally said before the game started, yo, Golden Tate has to wake up today and do something. He caught that first pass, his oh, yeah. his hip got fucked up. He got up, he was like, first down, man. <laughs> and then he I mean, caught the touchdown at the end. Crazy, yeah, I kind of have a confession to make, guys. Are we doing this again? Right? <laughs> no, I'm just that talk, serious. What y'all talk about? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. Um, Y'all yeah, bullshit because look at his No, 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 that's for real. He's not interested though. That's <laughs> <laughs> for I know something's up. <laughs> no, this is real shit. So, like, the last, you know, the last minutes of the game, they were pretty tense and all. You wanted them to lose. No, I didn't want them to lose. I didn't have anything. I didn't, fantasy's over and all that stuff. I didn't really have any reason for the want them to lose. So, you know, the last few minutes was stressful. I'm like, yo, like, the secondary's been playing well. Like, we haven't, like, give, we gave, we gave up. Don't fuck about without pre Satan. <laughs> no, we gave up big plays towards the end, which messed us up. But for overall, for the game, they really have that much yardage on us, like, or any big plays. We were stopping the run. We stopped Khalil Mack and all that. Everything was good. Obviously, that last play, uh, Amante Maddox, he got kind of, like, comfortable because he was locking up people, and he kind of jumped, and then he got burnt, but he tried to recover. That big pass led up for the field goal. So, you know, I'm like... First, the touchdown, I was bang, banging on everything. I was hyped. And they got the ball. I was like, oh, this is it. Like, I'm they're going to ice the kicker, and then he's probably still going to make it. And, yeah, so they went for the kick. First one went in. They called the timeout. Second one, obviously, he got tipped. I didn't know that. I just thought he missed it really bad because he was nervous or something. And, yeah, we ended up winning the game. I was cheering, you know, got excited as always. You know, I'm loud. I like sports and shit. I was like, you know when you're, like, nervous, you just start, like, like tapping stuff, and you, like, try, and when you're happy, you, like, make noise and shit, you're like, yeah, let's go, like, you start, like, yeah, yeah, So I punched the hole in my parents' living room. <laughs> when I thought that we won. Damn. I didn't punch. I, like, so I was, like, making noise, like, let's go, and I did that three times on my parents' wall, open-handed, and I made a hole about the size of my hand in their wall. <laughs> nice. <Yeah>. Hulk career. <laughs> My parents were like, yo, stop going to the gym. Like, that's it. You're cut off. I'm like, I'm not even that. I haven't, I haven't been going for that long. I was just, I was, no, it's the walls. I'm like, them John's, them John's weak. Because I didn't even go, like, I didn't even try to, like, fucking swing. Like, you I was just go tapping home it. And the wind took away your house. <laughs> your walls that weak. <laughs> for real. Like, it was some three pigs, a straw house and shit. Like, that's how it felt. But yeah, when I tell you, like, I hit it three times. And I, like, I was looking at the TV as I was doing it. So when I felt, like, a little give on my hand. And I look at it and my jaw just drops. <laughs> and it's like me, my sister, and my dad watching it. So I notice. And then my sister's like left, like jumping at the TV and she turns and she notices. So we're both like mouth open looking at it. And then my dad's still like, let's go, let's go. He turns around to give us a high five. He's like, <laughs> I would have just put my, my body over it. Like, <laughs> yeah. Bro, I'll tell you, that shit killed my whole mood. I was like, wow. And then I'm like, I felt like such a dick because I'm like, it's really not that deep that I put it on my parents' wall. So I just like, I was upset. And then I wake up the next day and I'm eating breakfast and my dad calls me crying, laughing. <laughs> He's like, yo, that shit was so funny. <laughs> he was talking about how like he saw a video. I don't know if y'all seen it, but some guy like basically watching the game, he got excited. and He broke like his wedding picture of him and his wife. So he was like, and they like went viral. So like my dad was like, yo, if I would have had a video of you and your sister, like, of y'all faces and like seeing that wall like we would have we would have been yeah <laughs> like it would have been a wrap so that's why he was cracking up laughing like he was like our faces when he turned around was priceless see we don't see, that's the thing about us we record when we want to but we gotta record when we don't want to yeah <laughs> that's when it matters that's when it matters we uh I, I couldn't even put a dent in my wall if I was in I, I have been angry and I have punched the wall in my house but my wall is straight concrete and I'll tell you the you wall don't break you yeah. can do you got <laughs> I'm not even that, like, that's funny, because I'm not even that type of person that, like, when I'm angry, I punch walls or anything like that. Like, it's not, that don't make sense to me. That was just me out of excitement, like, just being like, let's go, and it just... I remember somebody, like, I went over their house before. I might, get a, I might get a photo for y'all so y'all can see. Continue. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I remember somebody went over their house, and it, um, his brother, he told me that he got mad, and he punched the door. What I'm going to tell you, was it the door or the wall? I think it was, I don't, I don't know, but when I mean to tell you the hole that I saw on that wall, I had thought it was like a fight. Like somebody had thrown a person through that door, like that door wall. I was like, yo, how do you have this much energy? Like, 
I was like, I couldn't do it. <laughs> I was, <laughs> I was like, in my head, I'm like, yo, that low key, like, now I get like how people be breaking, like, you know, see the videos, people chopping bricks and shit. Only in my room, I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, all right, let's do this again. <laughs> I just keep breaking shit. <laughs> Start going to Home Depot buying, <laughs> buying plywood <laughs> in my you basement. Pre cut? No. <laughs> <laughs> I got it. I got it. <laughs> yeah, that, that was my little thing. I had to get out. See, it wasn't me bullshitting. I wasn't trying to prank you again. <laughs> Mark's like, let me guess. You got 50 girls pregnant. <laughs> you got married over the weekend. <laughs> they got an STD. So. Oh, no. And you adopted three Stop. kids. <laughs> Come here, guys. <laughs> and I put them under your name. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Daddy! <laughs> it's not like the American Dad John. <laughs> Daddy! It's just in the middle of the desert. I'm dead. Yeah, I'd be mad too if they were all my name. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Mark Jr., Marquina, Mark. <laughs> Marquan. Mar no! What's up, <laughs> <So, so>, bro? <laughs> I'm like, Daddy! Why do you look like me? <laughs> I'll be mad and be like, Marquand's not the black one. I'm a this boy. <laughs> That'd be fun, yo. It'd be low key hilarious if like a white family did that to their kid. Like like a red ginger, like pale ass white kid is like Daquan. <laughs> <laughs> you tell it to another family. Why? Daquan is like, Daquan? <laughs> You sure there's a big coin? I see a big coin. Yeah, it's our son right here. <laughs> that's fine. Oh! <laughs> like, yo, that's drawn. <laughs> the, the other man, he's like, like, you wish your mother, you got a black dad, don't you? He's like, nope. We're, we're both white. <laughs> we're both white. <laughs> yep. Who was it that, who was it that said, well, I think it was one of y'all that said that y'all named y'all kid, like somebody named their kid something in y'all family, but it sounded like a black name, but it was like not pronounced that way. What was it? Tanisha Lavon Vega? No, 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 no. no. Something else. I, it was like a baby name. That was just born recently or something like that. Oh, my cousin. Her, her baby's name is uh, Fatima. Uh, <laughs> Fatima. But, <laughs> but my aunt calls her Fatima. Damn, bro. She said it's not Fatima, it's Fatima. Yeah, let's see how many kids in school are that way. <laughs> like, yeah, all right, Fatima. <laughs> right? As soon as they try to, anyway, you want to piss her off. <laughs> Here's something at Vaughn where he's, the boy was like, He's acting like a substitute and he's reading oh, his yeah. name and he's like, uh, shithead? She's like, it's shitty! The <laughs> <laughs> yeah, first time I've seen that, I did not think it was going to go that way. I was cracking up. He's <laughs> like, uh, shithead? Or what's the other job? I was like, Michelle Mars, he did. He was like, he's like, when the teacher don't like you, it's like, Sabrina, Marcus, uh, fuckboy named Meech. He's like, the fuckboy is <laughs> silent. <laughs> <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> I'm dead. Good times. I said that'll be goodbye. What? No, Edwin, I was giving him ideas for his John. He said, uh, that'll be goodbye. <laughs> that'll be good. I think he meant to put, but it was like autocorrect or whatever. Ah. So it was like, that'll Good be goodbye. goodbye. <laughs> True. True. So, are we going to talk about the elephant in the room? Sure. <laughs> Is someone pregnant for real? Nah. <laughs> He's like, come on out. He's like, hey guys. I'm sick. Some fucking hooker just comes in, fucking pregnant as shit. It's like, Q, I don't think you remember this, but uh, remember that one night? <laughs> I get drugged. <laughs> I get drugged. <laughs> no, I'm so yeah. tired. Yeah, I mentioned it. How, like, our, uh, oh, yeah, our, our government. Yeah. <laughs> our government. Is uh, they're shut down. Is it half, half of it or is it all of it? Pretty sure it's all of it. Uh, for some reason, I don't know why I'm picking half of it. But yeah, yeah. government is, uh, you know, shut down. It's not the first time. It's it the longest like, time. It happens yeah. like every other month. Not every, every other year. No, but there was a time with like Obama job. I remember it was like around the same time. I mean, it was running pretty long. I think I mean, this was longer, longest though. I don't know, all I know is a lot of these, you know, federal workers, uh, the people in the military too. Basically government jobs overall. Yeah. They, they like, they don't know if they're even getting, like, credit. And it's all, this. isn't it like they're taking it to use for the wall? The whole, the whole, art, the whole like, issue is that they don't want to, like, close things out and reopen the government in a sense is because of the wall. Yeah. They're saying, like, we're not 
like the, the whole basically the whole reason is this is gonna happen is because we're not giving up until the wall is a thing. It's kind yeah. of stupid. That's why, yeah. People were worried about not giving their tax money, and they're like, nah, nah, we we were giving it out. But it makes no sense how they're taking money out, but they're not giving it back. Like yeah. somehow the government shut down, but they still <laughs> taking it right out your pocket. My fr- my uh. Not my friend, but this girl I know, she worked for TSA and she not uh she's not getting paid or she don't have insurance right now because of her job. She was on her job insurance. So that sucks. I don't know if I'm getting paid, yo. I'm so <laughs> my insurance is probably Yo, I was talking to Ash. <laughs> she was like, Aren't you worried? I'm like, I mean, yeah, it's it's pretty drawn, but she was like, Aren't you worried you're not gonna get paid? I'm like <laughs> that's 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 the <laughs> no, it wasn't, no, it's not like I'm coming at her, but I feel like when she first heard about it, she meant like Definitely. literally everybody is like not getting paid. Not getting paid. But I'm like, that's impossible. No, that's yeah. That, like, that's everybody it. was blown out of proportion. They're like, no one's getting paid. If you work for McDonald's, you're not getting your seven twenty five an hour. <laughs> it's like not relax. Enough. The government does not fund McDonald's. <laughs> I mean, we don't know. <laughs> that's what I'm true. But I was like, that's what I'm saying. I'm like, I'm pretty sure, you know, the government isn't what's keeping Best Buy up. <laughs> I heard you something yesterday. I just found it funny. Someone was like, I haven't seen a bird since the government shut down. Mm. <laughs> you see, yeah, I know. I think you've seen it, but you seen that thing with like people saying that pigeons aren't real. I think I brought it up on the podcast. Yeah, five. That was, like, people yeah, think, they yeah. said because they said they never seen a baby pigeon. <laughs> That's the dumbest shit <laughs> I've ever like. People, I said again. I, I'm pretty sure I've said this before on the podcast, but it's like the people realize that birds don't just like as soon as they hatch, they just out. <laughs> like they they gotta grow up a little bit, then they dip. Yeah, I mean it's not anybody's fault. You don't see it. It's just that they're baby. So yeah, yeah. they're in their nest. Motherfuckers want to see the baby all the the baby bird all. Hairless and all that, or featherless and all that. They want to see it with the eggshell still around it, flapping <laughs> two little cracks in the hole <laughs> on the street. Yeah, They're like how come I don't look like Bowser Jr.? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, I hate stuff like, like there's some theories. It's like all right, you got some weight to it, but it's like don't don't make you never seen a baby pigeon. Why pigeons are cameras? Even though like low key would be kind of a cool thing. I don't think. You mean? <laughs> like even if it like I don't think all of them are pigeons like is more realistic but more of like you can probably hide one in plain sight and people wouldn't peep. Mm-hmm. True. The like one that's just sitting there right across my streets. So I'm just, <laughs> like, just like just Woo! sitting there like, the whole time. Or that crow, you, or that crow that's on top of the church that never leaves across the street from my house. Well, every time it goes like ah, I'm like, oh, you tell my FBI agent I'm leaving. <laughs> ah, <laughs> nigga out, nigga out. <laughs> I repeat, the nigga's leaving. It'd be a whole lot easier to just have a bunch of regular pigeons and just one that just like yeah. has like close enough. I can already see that in like in a horror movie or some like yeah. thriller. You zoom into its eye, you just see like a lens. Yeah. <laughs> or like, I remember uh, like the whole movie goes on. The whole movie goes on, right? The person realized stuff is happening to them, but they re- they're not like knowing why. Like people know why like when she's leaving or what she's doing that day next day you know it all she hears one day when she's leaving is just that bird in the distance <laughs> that she's like going back in her head like wait hold up and realizing every day that it's just been there the whole time i might as well just make a movie <laughs> i'll do it what i hate about stuff like that in movies is like usually it's pretty obvious like i'm like yo how do you not peep that even though it's in plain sight because i have like one black eye and the one i just be red as shit for the camera i'm like dog <laughs> <laughs> you know, like don't that don't, don't that teddy bear look a little funny to you? <laughs> right. And then you hear a little noise too that it's zooming. Yeah. <laughs> it's like all right. And if you're in a very quiet room, you could always hear an electronic that's on. Yeah. You Yo. Hear that weird all right. Noise. I don't know if you ever. All right. So. Yes, I've had. Okay. I, thank I, you. I've always I've always heard it. My ears been amazing since <laughs> I was born. Thank born. you. Literally, I've like everyone in my noise. family will be like, yo, what, what the fuck are you about? talking about? I'll be in my, I'll be in the downstairs room, I'm like, yo, somebody left the TV on upstairs. I go turn it off, I'm like, how do you know that? I'm like, you don't hear that ringing sound, dog? Like, I don't know exactly you hear? where we're going. To. All right, because I'm old ass TV, like, yeah, and you turn it off, I'm like, ah, oh, silence. I still had that one, the box one from upstairs. Yeah. I still had that one, I used to play Smash. And my grandpa was Literally, I would just be sitting there, and sometimes, it would be my brother. My brother would always leave it on, like, never turn off. He'll turn the game view off, never turn the TV off. So when I like to leave and I'm coming upstairs or going, I don't know, wherever it was, I just hear the noise and I'm like, 
<laughs> my um the new TV I got it should just turns off by itself after like it realizes um once it has no source in it it'll just be like all right off or I do like the timer John turn it off I think I got that but I don't know everyone got timers I just turn mine off yeah <laughs> it's not that hard well it's not that it's just I know some people can't sleep without something on in the room I can definitely go to sleep with something everything off yeah. I all I need is black, yeah. <laughs> darkness, and I can do it. <laughs> and sometimes if I'm watching a movie, I'll just turn on a timer. I'm like, if I fall asleep, I'll fall asleep. If not, whenever the TV turns off, I'm like, all right, time to go to bed. Uh, what gets me tight with that is like, because like, my parents will be like that. Like They'll put like a movie on. They can never last like past the intro. They always <laughs> pass out. But then they leave it streaming, or like they'll play episodes or something of a documentary and shit, and they'll just keep playing and playing. And, I'll, and then we'll be, I'll be playing with y'all. So, as the tiger stalks its prey. <laughs> so literally, like, my brother, my, my, watching? my brother, my sister, and my parents would be watching Netflix or, like, a series, and it would just all be running episodes. Like, my brother would be watching that 70s show, and it would be playing, and then my sister would be watching They're supposed whatever. to stop it after, like, three episodes. I mean, if like, you don't touch it. Yeah, yeah, if you don't touch it at all, it'll stop. It'll be, like, after three episodes in or something, it'll be like, hey, you still watching? But if yeah. you, like, rewind like, so, shit, then, so, then it's not going to Some shows will be, like, a half hour to, like, an hour, so depending on what series you're watching. True. So it'll just be running and running and running. And I'll be playing with y'all, and I'm like, yo, there's three people watching streaming shit, and then my internet be garbage, and I can't go in there and turn it off because they sleeping. <sighs> yeah, I said, I don't know what the fuck was happening. I'm just like, I think it was when I turned off my Wii, then that shit uh, was better. Because yesterday, I couldn't even fucking, if I'm getting my own party, it was like, <laughs> you're kicked. I'm like, <laughs> I think it was just something of like restarting everything, because like, you were already running a server for creative, and then it was just, you had a uh, the party chat and all this other crap. I don't know, man. But yeah, that, that I don't TV, know how you can do it. I that TV. Anybody in my house watching something, they not. I be. I go straight to turn that John off. I be like, yep, you're not watching it. Well, too bad. If you wanted to, you'd be awake. <laughs> turn it off. <laughs> yeah, that that little. No, my my sister, she can't fall asleep without having the TV on. So, I be going out like I be used to turn it off, but then I I go upstairs. Five minutes later, hear the TV come back on. She'll turn it back on if she's like, and even though I'm, you know how Verizon they'll have like a, uh, like after like three hours it'll turn itself off. So then she'll turn it back on. I'm like, yo, just, just can't just leave it off. <laughs> no, nah, what you gonna call it on? Damn, for I was gonna say it's right there. TV. Um, yeah, something about TV. <laughs> Leaving it on. Something about that. The ringing sound. I want to say yeah. No. <laughs> Earlier. <laughs> yeah, all of that, man. Matters. <laughs> it said, uh, you know what prepared us for this is uh, St. Peter's High Frequency Test. Huh. <laughs> Raise your hand. Be inside the nerve. <laughs> to John. Then I'll do the other thing where he hits the knee. <laughs> God! <laughs> <laughs> Just uppercut him. <laughs> no, I couldn't get to that final stage, dog. It'll be the one It's like... No, not even. <laughs> it'll, it'll be, be, it'll be so real high. Hard. It'll be a very high frequency. And I'm like... This one, this one, this one. I'm like, fuck. <laughs> then it's like, <laughs> what the fuck? He just swinging. He, the doctor's like, yo, I didn't, I didn't press anything. <laughs> oh, he was just like, I heard yeah, it. I knew that. I was just stretching his arm. I was going to Ah, I was just practicing. That should run it back, run it back. He used to scare me. I ain't know. I was like, man, who I got good ears? <laughs> Damn, bro, I was going to say. Something about the TV. They probably used to get low, low, though. Them low F1 Jones. Oh, yeah. I'm like, just read your hands. I'm like, all right. Shit, when am I gonna <laughs> when am I gonna need to hear something this low? <laughs> no, but I I used to love going to the uh the eye test though. I got twenty twenty every time, dog. Shut up. Shut up. E. That shit B, is going down for me. Z Z X Y. That shit is going down for me, and it's no, because of how my room is set up. I just genuinely gravitate closer to the screen, and I don't mean to, but then I realize it sometimes. So I push myself back, but then once something happens in the game, my body just automatically gravitates closer, and it's really fucking my eyes up <laughs> really bad. Yeah. Um, I used to fucking when I used to do it. For granted, just stop now. I want to. Go back. I want to. There's no going back after this. I gotta eat my carrots, man. Fucking. Um, <laughs> I used to put a jam way too hard in my eye. So like I would like be like Aces John, <laughs> I'd be like pressure hard as shit like this. Like I never learned it's not there anymore. I, like, well, I never learned to just go like this, so, like just chill with it. I just be like close your eyes, push okay. down on this shit, and then when I open up this one, it's like all glossy and like blurry. I'm like fuck, wait, wait, wait. I'm like give me like two minutes. I'm like I gotta like 
<laughs> cue that. He's like, I right, just cover your right eye. He's like, <laughs> <laughs> he's like ah, oh fuck. <laughs> now I'm just like, what twenty? You have a problem. <laughs> No, 20 zero. Fucked. <laughs> eye patch. <laughs> just an eye patch. Huh? <laughs> he, gets, he gets excited, he gets to wear one. <laughs> right. <laughs> how does how does it manifest into a pirate? Hey, Q, you hungry? Oh, yeah. <laughs> It'll be like the boy from um, Dodgeball. Yeah, Steve. <laughs> Steve the pirate. Man just wanted to be a pirate so And then he's like, he's like, Steve, he's like, I got us to go. He's like, are you a pirate again? He's like, Arr. <laughs> <laughs> Cause he like he's like he changed he changed him man a uh, whole like button up shirt yeah he changed he, he like flipped up real quick cause he, he thought he had a smoothie thrown at him he's like you pirate freak <laughs> <laughs> Steve just turned into regular Steve and he's Steve like uh, hey man it's me Steve I'm not a pirate anymore he's like what <laughs> he's like yeah you know I just realized you're right I can't keep living life in fantasy. Sometimes you should tell that to actual people. <laughs> <laughs> you know what confuses me is like, I think it's just I think it just has to probably do with the, with who you are, but like, those that genre of movie, how do you pitch that? I don't know. It's like, like balls. Of, it's like balls of fear. That's what like, I'm right, saying. This is ping pong tournament. All that's right? what I'm saying. There's it's really there's, really serious. There's a company that obviously makes movies. For but like I feel like parodies. Like it would. It has to loops. depend on who you're going to because if it like if they would come to me. And give me that picture, I'll be like, fuck yeah, let's do this. Because, like, it's funny and stupid. Like, I don't want to be a fucking company that always want to make you cry. Like, I want to... That's the one problem I had with uh, that film company we were in. And when I snapped on them on my first year, it's because, like... I didn't even know this. <laughs> when I snapped on them... Not everything's drama! <laughs> exactly. No, because there was a lot of... Um, there was a lot of good videos. There was a lot of good videos, and they were, like all really good and they weren't all drama but the ones that were drama all got picked and i'm like i snapped i snapped on them and i snapped on them because i'm like yo are we you sure you're doing this off our votes and they're like yeah this is what you voted for i'm like really because i asked everyone in here what they voted for and they all voted for najib's uh video and then they're like oh well it's what you guys voted for and i'm like i, I don't i'm sorry but i don't believe any of you I feel like you're lying to all of us. I'm like, because the only, the only videos that y'all picked are the ones that were sad as shit and made all the people cry. And then I'm, I was dead ass snapping on them. And then um, I'm like, I'm sorry. I, I, I don't I, believe you. I can see, I can see him doing this. <laughs> yeah, because I, I got fed up. I'm like, I, just from my time of being here, I could tell this fucking program is shit. And I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, uh, I'm like, one, you guys don't give us enough time to fucking uh, edit. Like a day. <laughs> I'm like, you want? I was like, you don't give us enough time to come up with a good plot. You don't give us enough time to edit. You don't give us enough time to film. How are we gonna produce good content if you sitting here? And I'm like, you guys are picking the ones that you know are gonna make the audience, you know, tear up a bit, like. Half of these fucking drama documentary drones are fucking ass. Like, what the fuck? Because you saw somebody fake cry. They <laughs> <I> won. <laughs> so the video was just like, I have to pass the spelling bee. These words are hard. I can't do it. I did it. They got picked. Like, what, yo? I did it. <laughs> yo, know, it's so funny. Cause it's so untrue. <laughs> Your word is banana. This is my time. <laughs> B A N A N A A. You won. There, I choose. Fucking Oscar. <laughs> but yeah, like it's just like that genre is just weird. But yeah, what you're saying, like, oh, it's funny because you say that because it's just like the program being BS. Like literally yesterday, I was like, um, like the reason I was being quiet. Talk about well, hype. I was to get in that too. True. I was, with, I was with you that day. <laughs> when I did get caught with that. But uh, I was I like. Don't think it paid. <laughs> I was looking at um, <laughs> I was online um, like when we were playing. I was being quiet. Like I was on Indeed and I was Ow. looking for like internships and work and stuff. And there was some for like, and I was looking at companies that like were stuff that I actually give a shit about just because I don't work for some random like law firm or some shit and just hate life. So like, there was one company. It was like yeah, so we do like content production, video stuff like that, travel. And then one was like video games, and one was like sports. And I was like, this sounds cool. And then one of them was like, yeah, we need like, it was like, yeah, you need like three years plus of experience, all that shit. Mind you, it was entry level, which I don't know why, how the hell are you supposed to be like a beginner entry? is supposed to be your first job and they want three years of experience. You should at least only, like if it's an entry, you should at least be like a year. 
of experience. Like, yeah. At least like in a, in a year, it will be. That's just, when I would be like, I've been doing a podcast for three years. That's. <laughs> yeah. And that's what I'm saying. Like in the only year, year should be it. like just you knowing like stuff like that. Only like, skeptical. The only thing I'm skeptical of like because someone be asking for portfolios for creative jobs. And I would like to like put stuff like this on there, but it's just like it's hard because it swears and stuff like that. So I don't know how like the company would take that. True. So That's another thing. Like, if I had a chance to talk to CEOs of certain companies, I'd be like, "What's wrong? You, you never heard, said fuck before. What are you scared of? <laughs> fuck. <laughs> <laughs> fuck." You know, well, I was trying to get at with whole looking at like jobs, like because in the street was like, "Yeah, experience, like portfolio, like something. This is preferred. This and that." Mm-hmm. And it was like, "We need like we're looking for somebody who's like available certain hours a week." and we need to make this type of content. They provided a link. So I copied and pasted the link and it was literally like a YouTuber vlog of like typical travel, like slow-mo, like EDM music. And like, I'm like, yo, this is so basic. Like I, like you, instead of like, you need a four year degree in video content creation. I was like, yo, I can, I, I know how to do this myself just from doing the podcast with y'all and like just making dumb videos, which I could do this so easily without a degree. And y'all are like demanding for somebody to have a degree in this, this and three years I experience. This is what I'm saying. This is why I don't feel like like they, creative work, like you you shouldn't need a degree. You know what that is? It's <laughs> it's basically I don't know if com- big companies they see what's hot, so they're like, oh, vlogging's hot. All right. Well, they were just using it as an example of like yeah. this is the type of editing we need because the video had twenty eight million views. It's like one, yeah, but the, the guy's name is like Jay something. He's like a big no. YouTuber. No. <laughs> Jay, some I forgot. What, I'll look it up in a second. It's probably my history, but go go say what you're gonna say. Jay Sagittarius, it's like my. Uh, um, what I was saying is basically like these companies beforehand. They'll probably be like, "Oh, we need this type of edit," and they'll be like movie style, you know, big production type John. But like they see what's hot now, and what's hot is everyone's graduating gradu- uh, graduating towards uh, YouTube and um. You know, basically being content creators like David and uh, Team 10, all that shit. So, like, that's what they see. And they're like, oh, well, this is what we will make the most money off of. So, this is what we need. Yeah. And But the thing is, though, they see that and they're like, it's oh, Jay Alvarez. Yeah. Like, this is what it is. Literally slow-mos. Looks like a Taco Bell commercial. And just, like, <laughs> he has a decent camera. It's just slow-mos and corny shots like this. Like, anybody can do this. This is not a degree. A degree is like special effects, like after effects, like knowledge, and like just of doing. Of course, I mean this. Like CGI and shit. <laughs> I'm mean, sitting here with a GoPro. And got that's what I'm degrees. saying. Of course, he just has good. He just has good quality equipment and an editing software. And this is not a degree. That's what I'm saying. Not to mention, this man has money to get all this shit too. Yeah, it's a travel. Which is half like, of this was half of like the best part of this video. Looks like fucking one of the paws did this. You tripping? I couldn't do that. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Like, I obvious shit. Yeah, but like, like I can do that. Like I don't, I, I'm not even in the close to a major of like video editing. Like that shit is so basic. It's just like if you if you put me in that position of like, all right, let's go to like Cuba to a beach and like just, just do crazy <laughs> shit. I can get that footage and edit it the same way he did. You we see, like half of Twitter does that by themselves. That's what I'm saying. Well, I movie. <laughs> Bro, can we go like on vacation together? Now that you say, yeah, I was like, yo, I can imagine I'm down. recording videos. But anyway, yeah, continue because we'll talk about. Yeah, that it's later. just annoying, like. <laughs> Like, I don't know, I, I want to definitely, like, start to get footage together and start doing it because I got to build a portfolio because every creative job asks for that, like, especially with graphic design and stuff because I've been, that's why I've been making a lot of, like, I've been sending you guys, like, just edits and stuff and, like, logos and shit just I'm trying to build something off of that, just have a portfolio of it, but, yeah, it's just annoying. It's, like, for a lot of creative jobs, like, at this point, like, what they're asking for is not That's why a lot of times fair. you got to go for the one, the jobs that are kind of low key. And then from there, once you build something. Yeah, because you got to build that experience that they're asking for. But it's just once like. Once you build it there, it's like. What they're asking for is. I understand if they showed me like the Astro World video where it's like they did CGI and fucking like everything under the sun of like editing and crazy like green screen color coding. That experience, you need like crazy shit. Like if I'm working for like, what's a big like time movie come? Like whatever, like some Michael Bay shit. <laughs> and shit like that, then you need a degree. You need, you, like, 20 years experience. But, like, YouTuber vlogs? Come on. Right, you just need a camera and fucking... Because all of that is just regular <laughs> videos. You gotta remember, this is recording, like, how it's recording. us talking, but it depends you know, on what you, you edit, <laughs> which is basically... Yeah, like, people don't take it into account. It's, like, the fucking ticker reel, the fucking green screen, the, even on the Thursday video, the fucking side little box that I put down here today, like... The fucking, uh... You know who definitely has a good portfolio? 
those meme makers. They be doing those crazy edits for like their favorite shows. Yeah, but they don't be taking like, that shit serious, which is sad. Because they don't realize how hard that shit is. I'm, sorry. I'm just thinking about this. <laughs> Justice. <laughs> oh, yeah. But like, but like memes and shit, people, like they should be starting to take it serious. I feel like they are a little bit more because the has become more big deal. But they don't take memes and shit serious, even though it's harder than it is to edit. Because you see some of them, it's like, yo, they, this took time. Like you look at it sometimes. You ever, you look at memes and sometimes like, yo, who has the time to do this? With the tip of my finger and the fleck of my dick. <laughs> 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 but yeah, it's just annoying. I mean, obviously things aren't gonna change. Like, it's a lot longer to go. Cause like now people still like they expect you to, like. Like I also hate the whole idea of like having to wear be like the way you dress considers yourself professional. Oh yeah, I, I hate that. It. That's what I was like. That's what I'm saying. That's why I, like I would like to go. That's why one reason why I do like like the creative business side of like you know the creative industry stuff. Because, like, a lot of them, you know, they don't tell you you have to dress in a suit to go to work. Because, I mean, why do I need to be in a suit to help a That doesn't make me any less qualified. That's what I'm saying. Like, what is this going to do? Like, talk to me don't give me, if I'm good or not yet. Don't get me wrong. I like to dress up here and there with a nice uh, shirt. I'll and dress that, up. But, but like, the fact that it deems you Yeah, you know what I'm saying? saying? That's what I'm, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, I like dressing like that from time to time, but... If I dress in the jeans one day and a polo shirt the next, it shouldn't matter, you know? It shouldn't make me less qualified as an editor or, like, a business person or anything like that. Obviously, there's uniforms. And obviously, I guess, in a sense, you could think of that as a uniform. But, like, I don't know. I don't think it's really... Only time it's really necessary, I feel like, is when it's a bigger deal of, like, police officer stuff like that. Like, you need to identify who's what. But if you walk into a building where they are a lawyer firm and they're right dressed in regular clothes, like obviously these guys are lawyers, they're just dressed in regular clothes. Like you walk into a lawyer's office, you know what's going on. Or they're all but, not right, I'm, I'm done ranting. Uh, where can they find you guys? You can find me on Instagram and Twitter at Marky Mark. Uh, Quinn, where can they find you? Also, if you go to my page, you'll see some funny Justice League. <laughs> 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 so I just retweeted that. So like that video and the Spongebob John with Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> oh my god, that is the most, that, those are the main part of my two funniest like favorite videos. Where can they find you, Q? You can find me on Instagram, Twitter, Q, etc. And twitch.tv forward slash real, etc. Uh, Vic, where can they find you? And Instagram and Twitter, Vic. Young Dagger Vic. Et cetera, stuff is real, et cetera, on Instagram and Twitter. The email is, excuse me, real that, et cetera, at gmail.com. Put that in the, mm. <laughs> <laughs> type that in. I'm going to put that in the ticker. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Love y'all. See you next week. See me at Gotham, yo. Bye.